you guys, it's Rachel here with Sensa Tempo Cunny Corso. So I wanted to show you guys, I'm having an interesting dynamic that um, I really didn't expect. And I figured that I was working with the dog, so I might as well show you. Go lay down, Velocity, go! She's over here trying to cause ruckus. Had to send her off, she's outside. So there's a um, there's conflict, oddly enough, between, shh, go, now, between Grim and Don Juan, go! Now that I have Mad Mortigan out here, um, which is interesting. Mad Mortigan, come here. Let's go. Move it. Grim. So Grim is really trying to start something with um, with uh, <clears throat> with uh, with Don Juan. Mad Mortigan, go lay down. <clears throat> All that. <clears throat> lay down. Get. Shh, uh, uh. Shh. Quit. Shh. Quit. Cut it out. Quit. Stop it. Stop it. Um. Anyway, so the issue is that he keeps trying to start stuff with Don Juan for some reason, um, which is weird because he doesn't normally pay any attention to Don Juan. Um, he normally, um, only pays attention, um, like he just does whatever, you know what I'm saying? He's just out here. You guys have seen it. He's not really been doing that. And now that I have Matt Mortigan out here, he's steady, tre uh, steady trying to, um, dominate Don Juan. And I wonder, I wonder if what I'm seeing is them knowing that Mad Mortigan, you know, he's older, he's always been uh, one of the more dominant ones. And so I think that in, in, in Grimm's mind, he was always on the bottom because he is the youngest male. And so I think that, um, I think that he, he's steady trying to kind of mess with me a bit and I'm not going to let him do it to me. Um, anyway, he, uh, I think that for him, it's making him have um, uh, insecurity because of the fact, see that there's the play bow. See, um, I think that he, that he, um, is insecure because he doesn't know where he stands right now with, um, with Don Juan because he was lower. Uh, he was the lowest so he doesn't want to really be the lowest again so he's challenging he's trying to challenge Don Juan for that position so that he's not on the bottom um and we're just not going to do that here because Don, first of all Matt Mortigan's not even staying and second of all um as I've said before I don't allow my dogs to um I don't allow my dogs to grow in rank through aggression. Um, it just, it's just not allowed. Um, you have to do it a different way. So, um, so trying to fight your way to the top is just not allowed here. You can't do it. Um, velocity, you take your butt and you go lay down right now. Get Leave them puppies alone, you weirdo. Nobody asked you to be over there, Karen. She's getting onto them puppies, despite the fact that she's the one who walked up to the dang kennel. <clears throat> dang Karen and every... Jeez Louise, man. I'll tell you what, if it's been one thing, it's been another today. Go on, get... That, um lovely interruption was brought to you by Asia's son um, out of Don Juan he uh, hasn't learned how to be um, respectful yet this is his first time being out here y'all get off me right now don't you run into me I already got dead neat earlier dogs are trying to take me out today um I had a name for, I had a name for him, I swear, and then I forgot it. Uh yeah, I forgot it. Somebody asked where Preacher is. Preacher's 
Um, preacher's inside. Um, as I said, I'm trying to get him away from the, um, I'm trying to get him away from, uh, from the females. I'm also, I've got a vet visit for him at six. Um, because I think he may have, I don't know. He's, he's reminds me of how mad Mortigan was when he got tick-borne illness. And, um, the good, the good thing, or the, the thing about tick-borne illness that a lot of people don't know is that it can be treated with just 28 days of doxycycline. So, um, it's really not a big deal. And, uh, you just got to treat it when it happens. Um, and then you're good to go. So, um, most dogs have a, really bro, just rubbing up on me there, I see you. Um, most dogs have a very, um, like they have a ch genetic adaptation for, um, Lyme and tick-borne illnesses and they don't get chronic, um, Lyme and stuff like that. In fact, most dogs are not actually even, um, affected by having Lyme. So, anyway... Um, just food for thought, you know, whenever we get that, we treat it, um, and, uh, that's how it goes. So, in the three years I've been here, I've only seen it, if, if this is what it is, then I will have only seen it twice. And we pull ticks off the dogs all the time. Um, you know, some people would put stuff on their dogs. I, I don't, like, I don't see the medication, the, the pesticides that they're put on, as benign um i think that they're probably a big reason why dogs have um the cancer that they have and stuff like that i just don't i just don't think that um that that they've developed a, a truly um safe medication i just don't believe that um and i and that's my opinion i want to be very clear i don't have any evidence to support that um other than you know um, just, you know, believing that. So it is what it is. Everybody gets to make their own decision, but me, you know, I prefer to just, um, treat the dogs, um, whenever they have it and just deal with it that way. Um, same thing with fleas, you know, it's, it, we're finally kicking up into flea season. Dogs are just starting to itch. So I'm going to have to, um, give them all Dawn dish soap baths and then I'll put on, I'll put on a monthly preventative, um, for the last couple months, um, until we're done. We usually use nematodes on the soil and that does work, but unfortunately it's been so dry here that the nematodes are just not being able to do their job. So it is what it is, as they say. Um, but that's just kind of how we roll. I don't really, I like to be as minimal as possible. Um, only time we use it is when it gets to the point where it's just, you know, the dogs are just constantly, like, they're losing hair, things like that. That's whenever we do like to, because then you can get secondary infections. Like, it, you know, it does become something you do, you, that you need to manage. But in general, we like to have them free and clear as much as possible unless absolutely necessary. So, anyway, that's kind of how we roll. Switch, are you trying to come into heat? Starting to get jiggly back there. What you doing, ladies? What you doing, ladies? Sweet baby Mona. Sweet baby Mona. Yeah. No, you go away. You bad dog. Jolene. Jolene. Crazy dog. Crazy dog. Craziness. Craziness. Like catness, but craziness. Good boy, dumb one. Thank you. Thank you. He's like human. He's like dog shield. Dog shield activated. He's a good dog. He's a good boy. He's a good man. Where's Grim at? I can't see Grim. And I can't see my Mortigan. And that's probably not a good thing. <whistles> Come on. Come here now. Grim. Out. Yeah, that's right. Come on. Move it. I know you. You are trouble. Hell on wheels. That's what you are. I think you're smart, but I'm smarter. Come on. Let's go. Let's go. Are you bad dog? You bad dog? One of your sons. One of your sons is out there doing his thing. Barking his thing off. I had I had a customer call me and and ah and they wanted help with um with the barking 
and I was like, yeah, it's a grim puppy, all right. They, they can be loud, man. I know the struggle. <laughs> they think they're smart. They're a lot. They're a lot. I tell people that too, like, you know, Don Juan pups are easy. Um, <clears throat> Mad Mortigan pups are easy. Um, Preacher pups were never easy. They were the hardest, uh, which I think people are always stunned to find out, but they were. And um, what else? Um, get off me. Quit running into me. No, you. Shh. You, chill out. Um, shh. Girl. Um, Anakin pups are really easy. They're, they're very sweet dogs. Um, and I will say the, the Grim pups are super sweet, just like he is. He's super sweet. But having said that, they're like, they're stubborn in a very playful way. And they're loud. Like, I'm just, I'm not even going to sit here and pretend. They are very loud. Look at that. Look at that square. Look at that. Look at that. Nice and square. Square. You wide. You wide. Wide. You want to fight? You want to fight? Uh, you want to fight? You want to fight me? Play bow. <laughs> Nirvana, go away right now. Do not rile everybody up. Get Nirvana. Look at her trying to display. Get right now. You go. Don't you be a bad dog. No, ma'am. I did not ask you. You go right now. Nobody. No. She's like, let me in. Come on. Let me in. No, you don't need to be in here. Go. Nirvana. What did I say? You go. Now. Look at her trying to dominate everybody. Nirvana. Quit it. Go. Now. Nirvana. She's such a punk. What'd I say? You go. She's like, no, let me at him. No, you're not coming in here. Don't judge my tarp. It goes on top of my truck. I took the, um, it had this like thing, this uh, vine, uh, visor that went on the top and then it was like broken. So I had to take it off and it was leaking inside the truck. So now I have to tarp the truck. I'm trying to get it fixed, but the guy that does my um, auto work, I don't know. He didn't, he didn't answer my last text. So got to figure out what's going on. What are you guys doing? He's probably just busy because he's really good. And he's also like really affordable. Go. What are you eating? Anyway, all right, I'm going to let y'all go. Um, Got to do a preacher's vet visit anyway. Beasy. Rude. Switch. Rude. Come here. Switch. Now. What'd I say? Switch. Come here. Ooh, no. Switch. I'll tell you what, man. They are... Um, so the thing about Switch, I have to explain. So the thing about Switch that's interesting is that her mother is Trinity, which is um, the full sister to Nirvana's mother, Blondie. But they're different dogs. They're very different. And, um, and, uh, and they very much, it's almost like different family lines because I used like completely different dogs you know what I mean? From those, so I kept my Trinity line completely separate and bred them to separate dogs um, than I did um, Nirvana for the most part. I will say that I did put Nirvana to Mad Mortigan, and she's a daughter of Mad Mortigan, but it's still different. Um, so anyway, I do think it's funny that there's like a difference there. But anyway, I'm gonna let y'all go. Bye.